You have any idea how much fun that me shoot? All those fancy toys? Mom just could have got me one of those. Going back, some of our videos start at Walmart. Here we are again. You ever notice how the circle of life kind of leads you back there? Need groceries, go to Walmart. What reminded me is a little kid passed by not long ago and he was saying, I'm going to Wally World, Wally World. And it reminded me <clears throat> when I was younger, you know, to some kids, Wally World or Walmart really is kind of a treat. I don't know. Just food for thought, guys. Something to think about for a minute. I feel pretty blessed. Oh my god, where was this stuff when I was a kid? 12 inches by 200 feet of bubble wrap. You have any idea how much fun that me shoot? All those fancy toys? Mom just could have got me one of those. Would have been set for like, I don't know, an hour. Let's be real. Alrighty. Never saw this before. Heck yeah, guys, this was totally me when I was a kid. I'd be running up into the Walmart and being like, Check this out! Whoops. Dang, I've, my fingers are too fat. Ah, and the crowd goes wild. Anyway, and there it is, guys. A little bit of grocery shopping. We're a little broke, so, you know, we're not getting a whole lot. And I see, um, a wife is trying to hide it, I think. I'm not trying to hide anything. You put that in there. Oh, don't let her, don't let her <laughs> fool you. You did put that in there. Oh, don't let her fool you. Wifey wanted Twinkies. Isn't that right? I didn't want them, but I didn't put uh -huh. them in there. Uh-huh, so that's her excuse. And then she hides them so she doesn't have to see them until we get to the register. Well, and whoops, how did that get in there? You also want to show that? <laughs> um, hadn't planned on it, but... So, Twinkies and pregnancy <laughs> tests, guys. Maybe I'm pregnant, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, we'll see you guys a little later. That's it guys, our average trip to, uh, our adventure, excuse me, not trip, that's our adventure to the Wally World. We got our stuff, food, you know, cat litter, important stuff, woohoo. We go home now, you know, not every day is a barrel of monkeys. We barrel of monkeys? There's stuff on the lens cap, and there's about to be me on the lens cap. Anyway. Back into the beer. Ah! No, I didn't do it right. Back into the beard with you. So we're done with Walmart on our way home now. The adventure comes to a close. We decide to get to, hey, why you do this to me? Chilling my drink. And not even showing it either. You two, <laughs> all right, that's enough. Chilling my drink. You wanted that one. I couldn't drink much. Right. There was something stuck in the straw. Good. Anyway, so on our way home, we decided we're gonna go ahead and stop by some McDonald's and grab ourselves a couple drinks, because we were thirsty. I like the most frappe, wifey wanted sweet tea, something terrible. Maybe this is just me, but I remember a time when you could get a sweet tea or any other drink at McDonald's and the cap didn't go flying off spilling everything on you in the first sip. Like, I don't know if you can tell, my wifey ended up having an accident over there. I did. And, and this one came flying off of me and I got my hand all sticky, so that stinks. I hate sticky hands. I hate sticky hands. Anyway, so that's how we bring our adventures to a close. We get all sticky-handed and, you know, make a mess look like we peed ourselves. Ha ha! That's it. I don't know, maybe I'm the only one who feels that way. Anyone else remember when McDonald's didn't have caps that were just like kamikaze fly off the handle caps? They're like the most terrorist caps ever. <laughs> anyway, love you guys. We'll see you later, intro neighbors. Meow. Today, the we're not exactly celebrating is that...